Hey YouTube, this is Poketuria Trainer 200 and I'm going to be showing you guys a brand new store that opened here in Arizona called Silver Dragons Games. But yes, we're going to go in there. Uh, they do have Pokemon cards. I have been to this place before. But first, I'm going to give you guys a little tour of the place. It's a really cool place. They have a lot of awesome stuff. They have an awesome player. But yeah, here's the kind of the front stuff. And look, there's already Pokemon stuff, guys. See Pokemon guests. Actually, I've been thinking about maybe getting the Battle Academy. But yes, let's go inside, shall we? Look at all this cool stuff. They have board games and stuff. See? And more Pokemon stuff. Who knows? Maybe you might pick that up. Maybe a little bit. They have, they have a bunch of plushes. See, look at all these cute stuff. They're awesome. They have Pokemon plushes, but these are adorable. Look at that. This could be a Pokemon itself. Actually, it'd be a Kombi. They have a bunch of board games. This one's cute. I think I've seen this one before. They're all avocado, Dune. Ooh, they have like Marvel zombies. But yeah, here's all the board games that they have. They have cool D D uh, D and D dices that you can put your dices in. You have D and D, of course. I haven't played too much. Look at that thing. That's a Beholder, I believe. They have more D&D stuff. They also have Pokemon stuff. You guys know my channel is based off this boy, so... Tempting. Very tempting. I would love Dragon Shield. They have also deck boxes and stuff. Actually, I might need to pick up another binder for Yu-Gi-Oh, actually. More cool board games. Also, I think they have Star Wars, yes. If you guys don't know, I'm a huge Star Wars fan, so... I don't know. Maybe I might try this out. They have Battletech. They have a whole bunch of D&D minifigures. A whole, like, wall of them. And I'm gonna show you guys play area. This is the play area. They have, like, a little... They have a private room over there. And then, of course, our card game section. And, of course, what we're here came for... We were gonna get me one of those guys to open. Because you guys know me, I need that Charizard. Also, they have boxes, they have packs too. There. And then, of course, they have D&D dices here. Really cool ones, actually, honestly. These look really, really sick. They have more dices here. Bunch of cool dices. But yeah, this is uh, the whole story here. The awesome play area. So anyways, let's get the box and then of course let's open it when we go. home. So I'll see you guys there. Alright, we're back from the shop. If you guys haven't uh, seen, well actually this is the first part of it. Uh, I picked this box from the place I was showing you guys. So yes, we're back from it. And we got ourselves a Ascidian Flames Elite Trainer Box. And you guys see the playmat, you guys see the avatar and stuff. I really love Charizard, so uh, this is my first Elite Trainer box from this set. Actually, this is my second Elite Trainer box from Scarlet and Violet Arrow, but yeah, it has a lot of cool stuff in it. It has all these stuff, so we get nine packs of Sidian Flames. Let's hope for the Charizard. We get some awesome Charmander sleeves. Of course, we get a deck of energies. I actually I do think I need electric ones. The dice sexy looks super cool. We get a booklet, and of course, we get the box. And then we get this cool looking Charmander promo. Probably also I like this one because I like how Charmander's looking at Pidgey. It's just freaking funny. Anyway, so enough of me talking. You guys probably want to see this opened up. But yeah. Also, if you guys uh, want to check out that place, uh, if you didn't see the front of it, they're called Silver Dragon Games here in Arizona. They're in Peoria. And they're super awesome people. Actually, I talked with the owner, talked with some co uh, workers there, and they're super awesome, chill. Uh, definitely go check them out. They barely opened up last year. They had magic. They have Pokemon, of course, if you guys saw. Uh, they have like a D and D. They have an awesome like play area room. Where they even have like a fireplace. So just a really cool place. And uh, hopefully uh, they give us some luck. Also, the camera shaped a little bit. Sorry about that. Big box. I right, gotta take off the wrap. Gotta slide the box open. We got our little booklet this has like teaches you how to play the game and all that stuff also I wish magic still does shows you all the cards in the set 
Hopefully we can pull that, because I really like Terran Tire. But yeah, awesome thing. Also, if you guys don't know, this actually turns into art. I have some up actually on my walls in my room. I'm not going to show you guys, because you guys probably seen it. And we got our nice organized stuff in here. So we're going to take out this little divider thing. We got ourselves our nine packs of Ascinian Flames. It looks like they're kind of organized. They'll be a little random. Hopefully we can get a Charizard. I really want one very badly. We got ourselves Poison and Burn Counters. We got ourselves nice looking dice. I really actually like that red dice actually. That looks really cool. We got ourselves Dividers. I actually might use this box and actually... I know I have a... Also here's our awesome promo card. Actually, I might keep this sealed. I might not actually open it. Stacks of energies. Just, you know, if you need them. Of course, the code card. I actually do play the game, so I'm going to probably enter that after I'm done. And then our awesome pack of Charmander sleeves. Actually, it's funny. I have some Charizard Y sleeves from XY Evolutions. But yes, that's all our stuff. So I'm going to move this, put this all back in the box. And then we're going to move on to the packs. I'm going to save the Charizard pack for last because, I mean, it's Charizard. Also, we have sleeves just in case we pull anything crazy. But, yep, we got our nine packs, so we're going to save these ones for last. Is there any more Charizard packs? No? All right. Saving the Charizard ones packs for last. Hopefully, we get something good. All right. First pack, Rava Room. Also, I am thinking about actually, also, besides that, uh, if you're not subscribed yet, definitely subscribe to the channel. I would definitely appreciate it. I'm going to try to do a lot more stuff for the channel. Like I was just about to mention. Oh, the camera came a little. There we go. I'm hoping to do some live streams on Pokemon Live for you guys. And, of course, more openings. Maybe deck profiles. Cup Chew. Spoink. Espeon. That's a really cool Espeon. Floatzel. But, yeah. If you're not subscribed, definitely subscribe. Also, I would really appreciate it. My goal before this year ends is to hit 50 subscribers. So, if you can do that, I'll be super happy. Pidgeotto. Good old classic. Togekiss. And... Ooh! We actually got a full art Glamora EX. That looks cool. Well, wow, first pack in, we actually hit a pretty good card. <laughs> the code card. Whoops. Forgot about that. That's probably going to be redeemed. Alright, we're going to sleep up this bad boy real quick. There we go. Cool! First pack in, we actually get a Glamora. So, first hit. Let's see, so to do good, we got to get six, possibility. I mean, three is not bad, too. Oh, nine packs. Take the code card off. Gotta redeem that. Oh, all right, now that could be something. All right. Also, I'm gonna zoom in a little bit so you can see, guys can see the card. Got Dratini, Oddish, Thinizen, Herdier, Skunfisk, Salazar, What Trail. Actually, I would like to get a shiny version. It's actually blue, actually. Rhyme, as a reverse rare. I might just put the reverse rares together. The comma. I'll just sort it afterward. Dig through B. And we got a Palafin. And then we got ourselves a Fighting Energy. Alright. We're going to put good cards. No. We're going to ship good cards there. These cards here. There we go. Alright. Tarantar pack. Let's see if we can get Tarantar. EX. That would be super freaking cool. There we go. Code card. Let's see, Togepi, Lamplint, well, Lampint, Gloom, Bronzor. It's a cool looking artwork. It's like in snow. Flamingo, Bronzong. It makes sense. We got Bronzor. Beartic. Ooh, Magmazone. That's a really cool one. What does this mean? You may switch out your Pokemon's active Pokemon to the bench. Huh. This one does 30. Okay, it does damages. I actually didn't think about building Magma Zone EX. Dr uh, Dramaka. And. Ooh! We got a Crydon EX. 
So this is like a new different version. I actually have the one from Scarlet and Violet as gold. Cool, two hits. All right. I'm starting like to like this ETB. I'm telling you honestly, I don't remember how many hits we got our last ETB. That was the the ride on uh, EX thing. Cool, cool. I mean, actually, I wouldn't mind pulling the ride on. Sadly, I don't think it's good as the one from Scarlet and Violet because I mean, it does let you draw two cards. But the one in Scarlet and Violet lets you uh, use tandem unit, and you can just, you know... Ah, dang, I can't open these packs. So used to opening the Yu-Gi-Oh packs. If you guys don't know, I actually do have a Yu-Gi-Oh channel called Star Girls 200. So if you like Yu-Gi-Oh, definitely go get check that out, too. Okay, we got ourselves a Nose Pass. Litwick, one of my favorites. Actually, I do like Chandelier. I don't know. Charmander! Yeah, boy! Let's see if we can get a Charizard though. Salazar, what trio? Kangaskhan, Combi. That looks like a shiny. I don't actually, I think the shiny is a little more darker. I'm not too sure about that one. Numel, and we got ourselves a Darkrai. I really like this art, Darkrai. Looks super cool. Actually, I. Th oh, wait. That goes there. Andrew goes there. How many packs do we have? We have one, two, three, four, five. We have five packs left. We already got two hits, so we can get a couple more. I wouldn't mind. I mean, getting a Glamour was pretty cool. And Crydon's pretty cool, too. But we're after that Charizard. That's mainly what we want. I need it for the binder. <laughs> Let's see. Code card. So we got Heatmore. Little Pup. Toxel. Car Cadet. I think this might be its like third different version now. Bronzong, which is the Bronzor. Baratic. Charmeleon, our boy Charmeleon. We got Wiglet. Hey, that's to go with our what trio? Reverse rare. Audino. And. Wow. <laughs> it's not like we already got a Palafin already. So, looks cool. So, like, he's doing like a hero. I mean, he is uh, like a superhero type thing. So, it's kind of like he's doing like a hero punch. Ugh, can't open this. I still don't understand how you Pokemon players can open these packs. Sometimes these packs are difficult to open. Yu-Gi-Oh packs are like simple. Sometimes, sometimes they get a little hard. All right, we got Glimmit that can go with our Glamora. Rhyme. Also, I think we got something too. Rockruff. Got adorable. I like its shiny form when it's blue. Wiglet. Nine Tails. I still love that art of Nine Tails. Poltergeist to go with our new mom that we got in the DLC. Poltergeist, Told Scroll. Alright, I know we got something. Caps Kid, Bronzor, and we got a Victini EX. I'll take that. It looks super cool. I don't even think I have a Victini at all. This is nice. So, three hits. Wow, we're doing pretty. We got four and two EXs. Plus, I like this Fittini, actually. I don't know. Is it good in the fire deck? I know most fire decks are not great. It's kind of hard, but still, I might use it. All right, we still got three packs left. Wow, three hits. I'm happy. I was <laughs> like, not bad. We can get six, though. Well, we could. If all three of these packs have a hit in them, then we could, actually. Also, we haven't pulled an alternative art yet, too, so there's still that chance, too. Alright, Cocurd. We got Lavlatar. It looks like he's eating on Chicken Nuggy. <laughs> Clefable. Inke. Tulsa Shrule. Lunatone. T Terrestrina. Lycanroc. I really like that artwork of Lycanroc. We got Carvana. Sandlet. And we got a Skull Villain. The Pepper Pokemon. Alright. Our two Charizard packs. Can we pull a Charizard in the Charizard packs? Let's find out. I really want that alternative art Charizard. Actually, I'll take any Charizard. I'll take the normal form. I'll take the, the, the gold form. I'll take the alternative form. I'll take any. As long as it's a Charizard, I'm happy. You got Nomal. Graveyard. Tamano. Fanthrip. 
Grum Pig. I like that with the city background. Belly Bolt. That's freaking funny. Trevenant. We got Dragonair. That's a cool looking artwork. Some of these Pokemon artworks are really beautiful. Small of. And another Skull of. And Fire Energy. And I forgot the code card. Oops. So it's crazy with these ones, actually. Let me see, organize these real quick. We got two Skull Villains and two Palafins. That's crazy. Watch, we're gonna get like a third Palafin. All right, last pack, guys. Can we get that Charizard? Hopefully. All right, oh, let's just tore that pack apart. Code card. I wonder what I'm gonna get from the code card packs too. Sometimes, like when I open physical cards, I get nothing. But when I activate the code cards, I like get good stuff. It's not fair. <laughs> Rhyme. Why can't I get good stuff in the code packs and also real life? Rock Ruff, Wiglet, Shuckle, Amarose. That's a cool looking artwork. Or Ortega, Volcarona. I still want to train a Volcarona in Scarlet and Violet. All right. Here's our last chance. Can we pull alternative art? Can we pull another EX? Let's find out. Chandelier, one of my favorites. Swablu, and we pulled a Geta. Hey, lightning energy. Sadly, we did not end with a Charizard, but still, at least we got a full art. We got Karina and Victini, and these cards I do not own. I'm happy. Still no Charizard, but like I said, if you guys want, you know, stay tuned for this channel, we are definitely going to do more openings, so we're not done with the Seeding Flames. I'm not going to stop until I get that Charizard, so who knows? Maybe we might open more packs, blisters, uh, who knows, maybe a booster box. I have not opened a, a Pokemon booster box, so who knows, maybe I've saved up, maybe I might be able to get one. So anyways, like I said in the beginning of the video, make sure you're subscribed. Definitely if you're enjoying this content. And also, like I said, I have more stuff planned for this channel. I want to do more openings, maybe actual battles stuff with the cards that'll be super cool of course live streams on TCG live so if you want to see all of that make sure you subscribe also don't forget to like this video it really helps and don't forget to click the bell icon so whenever I upload a video we'll be notified straight away so make sure you click subscribe the like and the bell icon and I'll see you guys on the next one later guys